Radovan here. Thanks for tuning in to Survive the Swarm. So before I get going, I just wanted to let you all know I made some changes. Hey, everybody. I uh, made some changes to the mod. Um, so there will no longer be cat zombies because that was overwhelmingly annoying to everybody. I mean, I share your sentiment. So, yeah, that's something I did. Um, zombies are a little bit... Uh, more dangerous. I'm sure you're going to figure out why uh, pretty quickly. Uh, the Enable Clear Skies event has been enabled, although this isn't uh, currently reflected in the website. I haven't gotten time to do that. And uh, the entire soundtrack for this mod has been overhauled. So let me know if the audio volumes sound wrong to you or something like that. Um, all right, so here we go. We are starting off. So, uh, last episode, towards the end, there was a whole lot of additional uh, zombies re-entered into the map. But, um, luckily, fire does a pretty good job of murdering them. As you can see, uh, or here, I guess, more specifically, they're no longer... Um... Oh, well, thanks, Dry Thunderstorm. I really, really wanted my, uh, my deer farm set on fire. Uh, yeah, so as, as you can hear, they're no longer cats. Come on, Alice. Put that fire out. There we go. And, of course, this is already spreading. Bot is already down. Nice. I love when I start off and the bot's dead. Let me know if uh, the double bot problem is uh, still up and about. All right, so some zombies coming in from the storyteller here. How many did you just... 66? I see, I see. Whoa! Uh, we are already getting attacked here. Because we had a hole in our base. And Pat is going down. Yeah, that was quick. I don't know. Oh, everybody's trying to put the fire out that the zombies have been spreading. Let's see what we got going on here. He is more or less dead uh it had spread to his torso i'm not sure why i didn't get uh attack noises uh vtech survive it, he can survive this uh so let's immediately restrict stake home rather than close because that was the error there yeah there's a hole in the wall here that uh allowed a whole swarm of them in despite the fact that they're on fire all right so vtech you are going to be immediately going to the hospital. Pat, I'm going to send you to the hospital too, but I'm not exactly sure what I could do about that uh, torso infection. The arm and the leg, that I can solve. The torso, not so much. I do have heal mech serum uh, and res mech serum, so I might end up just murdering him and resurrecting him the friendly fire way, as we've established that it does work. A beer coming down from climb, so that works. And now I have zombies in my doorway, meaning I'm not going to easily be able to uh, separate them out. So Pat here, uh, yeah, let's go and do the friendly fire clearing. Uh, Eliza, you need a weapon. I don't really have any weapons at the moment, so that would be Casty's forte. She's already queued up to do that. I could euthanize him in operation, yeah. Well, um... Hmm. The only issue with euthanizing him is he does get murdered by someone, but alright, let's go cue that up. Alright, another thing I wanted to do is let's let's go ahead and put these um, zombies out. Nugget and everybody. Go do that. Uh, we're gonna need a doctor. Yeah, as you can see, Pat and VTech are already succumbing. Uh, we're gonna need a doctor to not to get you all patched up. Cheese, you want to do it? No, oh, Cheese is not set up to doctor. Yeah, let's fix that. Yeah, there is a great big fire going on. Now, I do want to open up the front door here, um, but maybe not just yet. 
I am working on putting out that front door. And we will start tending to them. So VTech, you are ready for... Um, what's the... You have a left foot. Uh, if it's just the foot... Oh, and right leg. So right leg and left foot. Uh, let's do a wooden left foot. And we'll fix it from there. So cheese, start off that operation. Uh, Dig, thanks for the resub. Okay, so what do we want to do here? We want to move these zombies out of the doorway, or at least the one zombie. So I'm going to haul that one out of the doorway. And then we should be a little bit safer. Uh, let's re-restrict everybody to stay home, and I'll deal with the swarm that I'm, I've am i got on top of me in just a second. Jeez, thanks for the subs gift. Uh, five gifts for you guys. Well, that was a rough way to start. Um, immediately getting bit and eaten. But, uh, yeah, it's a good, good way to sort of remember that uh, this is dangerous. So, um... Yes, zombies are significantly faster, as you might have already surmised. Fangface dropping a bionic leg for VTech, presumably. Uh, let's see, instead of that prosthetic leg, for the right one, we will do a bionic leg uh, once that lands. There we go. Bionic right, and prosthetic uh, wooden foot left. Alright, and then Pat here is going to be euthanized by cut in a second, and then revived, as that is the way we know how. t Sang, thanks for the uh, gifts out to the community. That is a whole lot of gifts, guys. Alright, so the wooden foot is done, and cheese, I wanted you to do this one. Oh, someone else is doing it. Alright, now that Pat is getting all patched up, oh, Jen is doing it. Well, she's high on wake up, so what is your... Mel, your medical skills six. Yeah, that was what I was fearing. Hold on one second. If we have really, really, really unskilled doctors doing surgeries, that's going to end up all sorts of terrible for everybody. So I fixed that. All right, already operating a VTech. All right, Pat here. You're now patched up. Let's go allow meds and euthanize by cut. All right, he's dead. A cheese enjoyed it. <laughs> uh, cheese, you don't have a lot of time to eat, so I'm going to eat real quick. Zarm is doing the spinal blade surgery. I guess that's fine. And, whoa, that was some weird click noises. Uh, cheese, we will have you... Use the last of my res serum on the person you killed. Alright, so VTech is patched up, and soon uh, Pat will be sort of back to normal. As you can see, all the other wounds that he had are resolved. I guess I could have also cut off his leg during that. It looks like these zombies, as you can see, yeah, these zombies are a mite bit quicker. Um... And they are stocking up in this hallway here. Euthanized by cut is indeed basically slitting the throat. Not a not a nice thing to do. Um, all right, so stay close. Here's what I'm going to do. Stay close. I am going to set them all to stay close, but I have certain doors uh, restricted, which will prevent them from walking into the into the um, into the horde here. And let me just remind myself where stay... So stay close should allow us to rebuild that wall, which is important. Jen, thanks for the gift. You guys are great. So, uh, let's allow them into this kill box. And we will start cleaning up the kill box. And repairing all the things that need repair. And... Tasty. I need to feed you some food. A beer in that... No, no, go eat. Go eat food. What is going on with the meals here? Um, assignments. Fine and simple is what we're currently eating. Uh, let's allow lavish etc. 
drop that along the lines. I also changed the drug policy off screen because it required a lot of tinkering, but this is basically what the drug policy looks like now. So Psychic T we take every two days. We keep one in the inventory, 88 plus, 78 plus for beer every day. Uh, Smoke Leaf and Ambrosia is sort of the really low mood. Uh, we don't keep one in our inventory so it doesn't spoil. And then wake up in um, antibiotics. So wake up is every three days just so we don't OD. There is a risk of a heart attack. Uh, so I do have to be careful about that. Looks like we're getting the farm going. Uh, one of the things I wanted to do is, yeah. Pat is going to get new priorities here. Constructing, mining... And I also wanted to change the grow policies because not everybody should be growing. Only people that have passions in it. There we go. Yeah, let, let me uh let me celebrate the saving of these people. What would that make me? A white knight or something like that? Ooh. Orbital bombardment. That's fun. Where is my white knight? Oh here it is. <laughs> A lady. <laughs> oh, it's so terrible. All right, there's a failsafe orbital bombardment dropped to me, just in case I need it, in case something goes wrong. Jeez, thanks again for the uh, sub gifts. All right, looks like my rice is a little low, uh, but this corn should be pretty uh, harvestable pretty soon. I would say these uh, psychic emanators probably could move around a little bit um, to, in yeah, uh, we're gonna, they're overlapping pretty hard. So VTech, you are up and despite the wooden foot, you have a moving of 102%, so you're faster. Uh, Pat, everybody is just like left Pat laying there, that's pretty brutal. Jen again with the uh, gifts. All right, so we should be slagging. Yeah, we are slagging out where uh, this turret was. Unfortunately, it got destroyed. And I think I'm going to remove roof over it um, so that if it does set on fire in the future... Oh, here you go. You can listen to some of the new soundtrack that I threw in. If we do end up um, on fire, at least maybe if there's rain, it can get put out. You wanted me to roleplay the message you sent, Klein. Uh, so, it was, the roleplay was, uh, orbital weapons back online and ready to assist. Please note, the undead are evolving and have become more dangerous. Godspeed calling. That mask is almost a zombie. Uh, I think I have one that's sort of close. I'm surprised, um, some of the masks that are available, um aren't Halloween themed yet. Man, look at these zombies. They really, really, really want to mess with me, huh? So, so, as far as I can tell, there should be... Yeah, there is no way for my guys to get, quote-unquote, out. And it makes me really, really nervous that we're this close to a door, but providing everything holds up, uh, this shouldn't be an issue. Uh, one thing I could do is burn up the zombies that are there uh, using a little Molotov trick, uh, but it doesn't really work when it is rainy. Oh, pet. I'm gonna go rescue you, put you in a bed. Alright, we do have a joy wire available, and ear implants, organs. I do need to make some weapons. Uh, Casty, it looks like you just finished... Really? With all of her skills, she makes a poor rifle. Well, I will equip it. Come on, you have a crafting of 15. How are you making poor weapons? Or not not how, but why, I think is the better question. All right, Case D, you, we want you up here. Um, and then also get rid of crafting. Let's take a look at crafting. Through. All right, there we go. Only one smith, one tailor. Some antibiotics coming down. What speed setting is the zombies at? So let's take a look. The Some of these zombies are moving at about three speed. Uh, that's about three times faster than they were before. 
just for a point of reference. There we go. Tasty is now back to crafting weapons. I also uh, enabled the showing the weapons that people have uh, on the bar up there. So I can tell who's unarmored. Uh, Time Bomb here is a pacifist. Um, but um, it looks like Pat needs a weapon. And then some of them need to get rid of their, uh, or just Casey needs to get rid of the, uh, the bolt action. And then we have some sniper rifles that aren't necessarily ideal either. Oh, rain, rain, go away. We have a lot of Turamine. Um, so this drug lab here, I'm going to put some Newt here. And I only really know how to make Yayo and Flake. So that's a bit of a downer. Uh, I guess I'm going to suspend that for now. Uh, taking a look at my tea, I'd probably prefer cranking tea out. How was my drugs? Oh, no, I have plenty of tea. We are coming down from a, a Jaeger. I'm just going to call you Jaeger. A better term. Uh, wildlife. So we have a lot of wildlife out on the map. I'd love to be able to hunt them, but uh, we are sort of stuck behind a swarm of trees one way or another. That's pretty metal if you ask me. Another thing I should probably invest in at some point is decent beds for everybody. Also, our animal population is growing, and I could probably throw down some additional zombie leather uh, furniture. Zombie leather, uh, just an FYI, is absolutely a terrible material to um, make clothing out of, because it offers pretty much no protection. But uh, for, you know, an animal bed, who cares, right? You know, you're not going to hide behind an animal bed. Resmec Serum coming down from Nika. Uh, sort of a nice failsafe. I probably should get a, um, a, a a place to store that stuff where it's more secure. Looks like they're backing off of the uh, the door here. They no longer rem... The, the zombies um, have a very, very long memory for uh, sounds now. That's another thing I changed, but um, it's not infinite. So eventually they will move off and move away. And we're pretty low on wood, so let's go ahead and harvest these trees. I really wish it would stop. Oh, this should be enabled. So let's take a look at all the emanators. Yeah, now, as you can see, they're not so... Yeah, this one is overlapping a bit. So what I'm going to do is, this will be an emanator set up mostly for the barracks. I'm not going to worry about people in that farm. Nah, or maybe I'll put this emanator. Hmm. A relationship. Arriving in a group. Uh, Dig sent. Ran aunt of Tadpole. So, she's already probably pretty frail. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, her move speed... She must be a... Oh, fast walker. I was going to say a jogger or a fast walker, because her move speed is actually pretty decent. I have a lot of psychic emanators. Uh, that does just about... I mean, there's a lot of overlap, but it does... Oh, even more. Okay. It does uh, make sure I don't have a lot of um, mental breaks. The mental breaks, you know, in a zombie apocalypse are pretty damning. Um, this one will cover some of the craft room here and the hospital. There we go. That is pretty good coverage now. So we are researching deep drilling. Um... I probably should invest in medicine production and things like that. Um, antibiotics. But I guess I guess we'll just keep going with deep drilling. So now I think I need to make something happen. Um, I Alright, so here's what I'll do. 
Uh, I'm going to create a zone called Hodor and put the Holdor zone right in the middle of the door there. And then animals. We are going to take um, Max, or uh, let's take a... I'm trying to think. Chilla. That's a pregnant chinchilla. Um, we have two female rats, so Max, this one is going to be you. All the idle people are going to go man the kill box, and we're going to go clear out some zombies. And let's go ahead and restrict everybody to stay home, because Nugget was about to go somewhere bad and get himself somewhat killed. Alright, where is the animal... Max. To the Hodor, my friend. To the Hodor. He is not really moving. Just, oh, he's being trained right now? Alright. Quit training him. We got a raid relationship coming in. I don't know what happened to the other visitors. Whoa, this is a significantly large raid. Uh, four Doomsday launchers? Four triple launchers? I think this uh, raid is going to self-immolate, if you ask me. Um, I'm going to unrestrict everybody. Happy Pants and True and Dev and APO. Let's go try to nuke these guys. Oh, here we go. Battle music. I think they're doing just as much damage to themselves as they are to the zombies. Um, but it looks like I'm currently set up to shoot at center. Oh, we did get some hits. Yeah, I definitely could save the rat now. The rat's actually been uh, mis mostly disobedient and not actually heading to where I told it to go anyway. Another thing I wanted to do is slug turrets. So I'm going to put slug turrets in here instead of the um, auto cannons, And that way they're going to rip down line really powerful tools. The battle music is super cool. Wow, thanks. I spent some t a considerable time trying to curate a soundtrack for the combat that we have. Fix the wall with the distraction. Uh, yeah, they're still sort of hanging around. The problem is, uh, maybe Nugget could do it. It's it's really a dangerous thing to do, I'll be honest. Um, Alright, do we have granite? We do have a little bit of granite, so let's actually... This was built in sandstone. Let's build it in granite so that it's uh, a little bit more hardy. Um... At the moment, I think there are zombies too close, but I will get um, Nugget to pull and granite that direction. Oh, there's an opening now. Go, Nugget, go. Nope, there's not an opening. So I, I left the granite there, and that way... Oh, maybe there's... The thing is, these zombies are really moving now. Um, which means... It definitely is more challenging than it ever once was. You can see they are... They're no longer slow. They're sort of more like rage zombies. Uh, let's change our target... To that mass of people. Alright, so the walls have been rebuilt. 
That way we can uh, unforbid this door, which I've already done. I've been getting some direct hits here. But I think uh, the map is more or less out of zombies. And all of this constant rain is not really going to allow for... Um, for... Oh, thanks for the bits, Jen. Tweaks and raids and sounds. Yeah, I'm trying to keep breathe new life into this series. Oh, that was a good hit. That was a very good hit. You guys just annihilated that guy. Uh... Spacemen unite. I'm going to try to bomb you. Oh, they just set a grenade on fire. Damien is now sanguine. Probably wise. Cookie Bunny sending some more zombies from the southeast. As you can see, these zombies can move. Uh, they are no longer slow shambling. They're a little bit scarier. Alright, Nugget. I'm going to back to stay home we're just about out of the shells that we have so now it's time to most of the really crazy weapons that the enemies had are um, taken care of they're inevitably gonna break through so yeah let's get everybody ready that means that auto door is gone, but hey, happens. All right, come on, guys. Oh, they're so dead. They are so dead. I've got such a huge mass of people waiting to kill them. And there's still some zombies in the area. Oh, that just took one to make them flee. Interesting. Did not see that as being the tipping point. Um, Nugget. I'm going to try to get you to stay close and replace that pronto. A regular group of more additional raiders, mostly all but one is melee, uh, coming my way. But never mind. Time bomb, you can take a time out. True. What's... Oh, yeah, yeah, brain damage. I was waiting for the tolerance to go away so that he could use heal mech serum. Zombies coming in from Cookie Bunny from the northeast. I don't know what your wagers are, but those are some pretty large swarms. Battle music going on. He's saying maybe don't YOLO by yourself. I know this isn't the most ideal defensive setup. Uh, it would be a little bit better if we had um, sandbags laid out, wouldn't it? Oh, are you sappers? Ah, oh, they're sappers. Well, they're about to walk into hell, so I'm not going to really worry about setting up anti-sap stuff. Hero mech trainer, drop it down from Damien. And Sihoro is the one that sent this raid. This trainer is for crafting. That's awesome. Casty will use the finish. Right, well, he's messing up my sandstone wall, but it could be worse. I can't believe these guys haven't fled yet. Also, uh, forgot message for my pawn. Uh, wait, what? There was a message. Oh, the Neuromech Trainer is for your pawn. Ah, my bad. Well, Damien, we will get that used on you before I forget. So this raid is already retreating. Uh, we're going to have a lot of repair to do. Um, so Nugget, you're set to stay close. I think I want uh, Nugget to immediately work on that other door. In fact, uh, I think I'm going to place this auto door here instead. And that way we have access to repair all the walls together. Whoa. 
Oh. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh, cowboy. What is he trying to do? He's trying to run out to these components. Yeah, no, not gonna happen. Alright, we're still, we're already being overrun. Uh, let's see, who is Damien? I need to let you go. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'm going to forbid this and restrict him again to stay home. Oh man, they are much faster, aren't they? And then, of course, there's all this wealth gear that got dropped from the raiders, and I'm sure there's a lot more out here as well. Much oh, you know what? I'm really significantly low on uranium. I'm not going to use that uranium for the slug. Not right now. All these doors should be closing behind me. I'm going to forbid them. Restrict, stay... Okay, yep, that all... Looks correct to me. There we go. Even cleaner now. Bot is F. Already, huh? I'll drink when the bot dies. Oh, we have a breach. We have a uh, eastern breach into the walls. I guess they must have bashed their way in. And this is why I double insulate. Uh, Sihoro sending in some uranium. I'm also going to have to... Well, we're in the middle of um, researching deep drilling, so soon maybe uranium won't be a problem. Hat is al up and alive. So far not showing any signs of um, mental degradation. That's good. Darm's got inspired surgery. Bot is lagging up everything. Gold coming down from X Games. Visitor from Palance. Uh, rip visitor. Alice, you're starving. Oh, do I not have? Hmm. All right. So lavish, etc. Uh, for now, I guess I'm really, really low on food. I'm gonna allow uh, insect jellies to be included. Uranium from Pop Rock, beer from Crazy Chris, uranium from Ryan A, Guy, something like that. Alright, I think what I need to do is um, stop making lavish meals, make fine meals, make it out of whatever meat we can find. Maybe not human or zombie, uh, but insect. And then um, that will we'll be able to feed ourselves a little bit easier. Uh, I do have a lot of survival meals, so I think what I'll do here is Lapis Etc. is going to include a pack of survival meals because we're a bit low on food, and then I'm going to have to um, uh, invest in maybe some additional hydroponics. More zombies coming in from red. You summon 67. And Emanian. Uh, resubs. Thanks. Are these real elephants? They are. They're not zombie elephants. Interesting. Now, I'd like to... I have a lot of breaches everywhere. I'd like to try to solve some of the breaches before I get wild and crazy anywhere else. Um, let's see. Opponents. What are what's in this? Uh, there's some components in this mountain. There's also a bunch of steel. So as far as mining goes, tadpole will be the lowest skilled miner that I have. Alice, you're gonna stay. Uh, research. Yeah, you're significantly better than everyone else at, at it. And here comes a new flood of uh, happy-go-lucky zombies. Right. 
Casty is making shells. Uh, our steel is looking pretty sad, if you ask me. So let's get some steel mining going up in these tunnels. Uh, that way we don't run out. That would be bad. Somewhat of a livelihood, I would say. Alright, Dev, you are on a major break. Why? Because you're hungry. Guess what? You are able to eat survival meals. Alright, all of my turrets are now emptied. It is still raining. Come on, rain, go away. Increase skill, then level up and shooting. You know, I'm gonna call you uh, Annie Oakley or something like that. Keep leveling up like that. All right, so that's all of the steel nodes that I currently know about. We got about 80 in the kill box. Now, unfortunately, the bombardment targeter is not accurate enough to bombard these guys without significant collateral damage. Hopefully, we uh, we get to clear out some of the uh, the rain or something like that. All right, Casey, you're still working on. We have two assault rifles that are unequipped. Where? Where? Well, what, no, I don't. I don't believe you. Where are they? I don't see them. He's like, ah, oh, my queue's done. Oh, you know what? It's probably counting all the ones out here that are um uh unobtainable. That's got to be what's going on. There's even a minigun out there. Oh, damn. Bionic Heart coming down. Cheese wants to become Iron Man. I can get behind that. Alright, so as far as assignments go, we're back to meds for everybody. Operations. Install Bionic Heart. Chocolate coming down from Night Divinity. Cheese is waiting for a viable surgeon. Gherkin. Check your health. Oh, actually, let's go to numbers. Whoa, my numbers are big. Surgery success chance. Uh, Zarm is more likely to have a successful surgery than McGurkin. All right, McGurk. We're going to go with Zarm here. Zarm. E-A-R-M. And he has an inspired surgery, so this should be just fine. Uranium coming down. 3.6. Not great. Not terrible. Oh, well, that's of rent gen, but not uranium. But fair enough. Point taken. Reference understood. Alright. Cheese becoming Iron Man here. There he is. And Cheese's heart. Now, just sort of sitting there. Okay. Uh. Oh, well, there goes a bunch of the uh, elephants that I was hoping to maybe, you know, do something about. It looks like everybody in the community right now has work to be done, which is pretty cool. I definitely would like to patch up that wall. I can definitely foresee that backfiring on me not having that built or secured or anything like that. Another thing I need to think about is some of the food scarcity that I'm currently running into. Now, I did just get some rice. Uh, why? Okay, so we do have fine meals that are made of insect meat um, and rice. And I think what I'll do is I uh, forget the lavish or simple meals. We have enough for... The, the rice will go further if we don't use it poorly. Alright, so instead of um, make up until, I'm just going to do, I'm just going to force Casty to make like X amount. Uh, she's also replenishing the amount of shells that we used up. And uh, it is currently not uh, raining, so. So, Damien. 
how you feel about bombing some zombies. We're surely going to destroy a lot of good stuff here, but... Um... You might save me a... Oh, nice hit, Damien. These zombies are quite attuned to the sound. They immediately respond. And there goes my components. He literally shot, like, the only thing that I didn't want him to shoot. And that shot, uh, went into a mountain somewhere. Alright, so we got an alpaca that's self-tamed. Um. Hmm. Are you a zombie? No, you're not a zombie. Alright, zone. Area 1. Is alpaca go to area 1. Might be able to get her through and in, going that way. My Iron Man is up on his feet. The new pole is up. Cool. All right, let's see how well that uh, fire expands. And uh, let me put up this pole. There's a lot of grunting going on. Alright, there we go. Pulls up. Oh, that, that, that way. That way. Yeah, pulls up. I don't want to hear those zombies anymore. You guys sound ridiculous. But you're on fire, and that's all that counts. Great. Removal of neurotic. Nice. Lisa's no longer neurotic. Oh, for a second it looked like uh, Nugget was going, you know, somewhere where he should not be going. It worried me. Briefly. Alright, we do have another uh, assault rifle. Pat, when you wake up, you get to equip that. I think I think I have a fire problem. <laughs> How did this guy not turn? Oh, he got shot to death. Good old fat. Yeah, he was one of the raiders. Oh, and there is a rainy thunderstorm ruining my zombie purge. Deep drilling's done. Deep drilling means nothing when you don't have ground penetrating radar, though. So we'll get that up next. We've gone from 300 steel to a bunch... We have 1,300 or so now, but it's going to go up and up and up as I continue to mine. Sounds like sad music. What's going to happen to me? How was the music sa sounds? Uh, no, my turrets aren't on fire. Uranium turrets are fireproof. So there might be fire around the turrets, but the turrets aren't on fire. A little bit of a difference, but a distinct one. Um, I know it benefits me, but um, could someone try to purchase the Clear Skies event? It should work. I'm, I know, you know, it would make it easier to clear out these zombies, but. Got big old holes in the base. Another thing I could do, actually, is, um... Where is... Che Alright, Cheese and Ward and Aliza. Let's get you up here. And we'll add Can, because he's nearby. Also is nearby. Happy Pants and VTech. VTech's like, not again! No! Alright, I'm trying to clear out this, um... Oh god, there's elephants here? That's horrifying. Trying to clear out these uh, wall breaching invaders. Invaders must die. So I'm attempting to lure them away. Dev, would you be so kind as to close this door to keep our animals safe? These guys are being lured. 
go. Come on, heli fence. Alright, time. No, not time bomb. Ashbourne. No, you have a sniper up on McGurkin. You have a chain shotty. Witsy, have you join us? Uh, traits. Industrious for Eliza. Chocolate from Slobo. And, um, cargo pods from AI. Of Agave. That would be really, really nice if I could, you know, get to it. Pat, come join us. Okay, come join us. Gender swap. Eliza is now female. Manhunter pack from Iris of a whole lot of elephants. Well, that'll be interesting. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. I want to try to kill some of these. Uh... Oh, yeah. We got a battle music from the Manhunter pack. I'm trying to drag them out in the open so I have some will room, some escape space. But now that these zombies are really, really fast, uh, it is certainly a little bit more dangerous than it ever once was. And, okay, this is not gonna work, not gonna work, not gonna work, not gonna work. Um, cheese. Taking a bullet. Because we have swarms coming in. We got... I, I don't want a polar bear express all over again. Um, well, I'm glad Cheese was Iron Man because he was able to get there really, really fast. All right, so let's grab everybody. And... I'm going to have to pull up somewhere. Now, Nugget, I don't know if it's going to be possible to keep that door alive. But I'm going to have you try to repair it. You are 17 construction. That should be pretty good. Uh, looks like we, um... Oh, man, this is about to get... It's all sorts of crazy. All right, Cheese, you were just shot in an architect arm. That's not going to be that serious. In fact, let's have you and, um... Time Bomb won't do it. Time Bomb, you could go over there. He's saying, let's have you man it. The uh, rain stopped, so I'm going to try to firebomb. Nugget looks... I'm really glad I closed that door when I did. Nugget looks like he is uh, repairing said door properly. Oh, boy. Uh, fast learner for Lisa. Oh, no. That, that door is going down. That door is going down. Um... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go in here and make this sort of a last stand scenario. Time bomb, go close this. It should ignore you. I don't really have any brawlers. But, um... Zarm, Nugget, El Eliza. You are going to be in the front lines here because you've got... Oh, you know what, Zarm? Where are you? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. T you and TX just start running there. You are not close at all. All right, so back to the numbers here. We've got um, Nugget. Aliza APO, you guys are going to be the front line against the uh, zombies. Oh boy, this is uh, this is going to be intense. Some of these things are going to be... That door is standing. A lot of these um, elephants are 
zombified? All right, if the door is standing, nugget. I want you to go try to repair that thing ASAP. No one's touched this door yet. You guys are repairing the walls. Okay, uh, as far as the goals go, I think we're pretty good at letting you all vote. So cave system and would be the primary, and the hospital would be the secondary. All right, still coming down from Vree. Don't forget about that alpaca that's self-tamed. Yeah, I haven't uh, forgotten about that. That alpaca, I think I just want to become food. But uh, not something I can currently focus on. All right, door's looking okay. The trouble is, all of these... um. All these um, all these uh, elephants are doomed to be zombie elephants at this point. Um, McGurkin, and cheese, and cheese. I think you're now what Iron Man. And this is why I really wanted to patch up that hole. Now we have a considerable swath of the base sort of overrun. Thanks for that tip, JFK. That's useful. All right, so cheese and um, tea saying. I'm going to move you up here. Uh, let's get you manning these mortars. Here is sending some wake up. Light Void sending more zombies. Oh, hello, zombies. Because they all set themselves on fire. Where's my fire alert? As long as I'm restricted to be from being there, I guess it's fine. What's he saying? I meant for you to man this mortar. All right, so another thing I want to do, uh, and Mord, it's going to be you because you're standing next to it. I think right now I don't need any hunters, so let's get rid of that. Oh my god, it is getting so significantly worse. Well, at least that fire is going. Um, you guys... Try to aim here, I guess. All right, never mind, Mord. No one's at that door to set on fire. And it's raining again. Oh boy. The faster, more rage-induced zombies, definitely scarier. Okay, that is roughly where I wanted to hit. I want to try to burn up some of these corpses before, um, you know, before too late. All right, a sign. Everybody is going to get back to simple lavish. That new horde doesn't play around. Yeah, they're, they move a lot faster. Um, I'm going to activate this soother. Casey, you're still making the sorrowfuls. Cheese. I'm gonna have you try. Wow, they are really all sorts of rage induced. There we go. Set you on fire through the walls. Chat event, clear weather. Perfect. Thank you, Necro.
I'm definitely gonna have an elephant zombie issue for sure. There's a whole lot of them. Alright, so that is an excellent assault rifle. Um, Tasty, you're gonna take that for yourself. We're out of, uh, we're out of shells. Uh, let's see, you have a strange feeling. I'm gonna risk wake up on her. Maybe I don't even, uh, I should have some, shouldn't I? And I think this, if I did, it would be stockpiled right there. I don't know how these people can sleep, knowing that Calamity is a, uh, just a thin wall away. But these guys are all setting on fire. Necronasty definitely made that happen. I think mortar shells aren't on the list purposefully, uh, for balancing reasons and stuff like that. Okay, burn, baby, burn. Some of these elephants had their heads ripped off, I think. Oh no, they just haven't turned yet. There's not a whole lot left in the kill box here. Which I am certainly unbelievably eager to... Oh no, but... Okay, well, the materials can't burn, so... Mr. Nugget. You're not up yet. Chocolate coming down from Crazy Chris. Thanks, Crazy. Alright, Nugget and Ashbourne are the ones that can be useful repair people. Oh, look, the uh, somehow the wake-up survived. As far as restrict goes, if we set to stay close, I don't believe that there are any doors that allow my guys to get over here. Jen sending down some more um, uranium. Awesome. We'll have to keep a close eye on them, though. Because as you can see, VTech, for instance, is heading to the wrong side of everywhere to set the fire. So, actually, forget the firefighting. That should stop them from sacrificing themselves. All right, Nugget decided to have the longest rest ever. Ashborn, would you... Um... Okay, we do have that, uh, that alpaca. I'm going to set the alpaca to pets. Then you shouldn't be doing that. Alright, looks like they're going to try to go around and be very... They're going to endanger themselves, so I'm going to rest restrict them again. Uh, uranium coming down from red. Alright, Ashbourne is working on this door. Oh, for a second I thought that was a... Yeah. Nope, oh, you're friendly. Alright, let's build copy. VTech. Um... All right, so the stay home zone still not really working correctly. And we got a raid coming in from the Grey Thugs. Again, another doomsday equipped raid. Wake up coming down. And Ashbo, oh, and JD is on a bit of a mental break. Um, all right, Cheese is in a social fight. That's unfortunate. Uh, numbers. So we need... Nugget. You're gonna grab the bombardment targeter. You're gonna try to bombard this incoming raid because nothing is constructed right now. And this raid is likely to just bust on through. Everybody else, head on down. Whoa. 
Okay, more zombies coming in. I was wondering what that giant lag spike was. Nugget, time for you to get out of dodge. Uh, they definitely, definitely died. Zombs no more. Alright, restrict. Stay close. Stay close. Oops, what am I doing? Uh, architect. Get rid of. Khan says capture me. I don't know. There is Khan here. Well, you are missing all of your important body parts. Architect leg coming from Kubi. Um, so Kubi, uh, who do you want to have that? Is my next question. All right, so this door got constructed. Um, stay close. Should include these walls so that we can repair them. There's a raid relationship on yet another one. Um, triples. And these guys are going to run straight into zombies, I think. Masia and Tragic, thanks for the resubs. Just noticed both of your resubs. Well, let's get these guys uh, lifted. Yeah, as you can see, these zombies don't mess around. They are evil swarmers now. They're not shamblers. They have evolved. Alright, Mr. Nugget. What if I really, 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 really wanted this wall to not fall? Could you be... Help me out with that. Alright, looks good. Looks good. Definitely improving the area for sure. Now another thing I wanted to do is just another door so that we have two points of failure, not just one. And then I'll put a, yet another one over here somewhere. Just so that we have some nice airlocks. Uh, this might be Resident Evil. They might just get stronger and stronger as I tech up. So I should have a pack of meat somewhere, right? Yep, I think we killed it. Uh, ground penetrating radar just finished. Okay, so what do we really need? Uh, transport pods would be pretty cool. Uh, sterile materials would be better for the hospital. So we'll get that researched, because that is part of the goals. So you all said expand the tunnels. Um, so the first thing... Oh, that is a really weird place to be hauling a dead alpaca. So the first thing I'm going to do to expand these tunnels... Oh, this is forbidden. That's what's going on. Oh, speaking of forbidden... Uh, Mr. Nugget. Be to build this pronto. Get you out there. Uh, Crimson Rust, thanks for the hit. the bits, baby. Celebrating that orbital strike. That was a pretty good one. That was clutch. Alright, so I think I've learned my lesson around this area. Um... That this spot here really likes to get breached a lot. I could double wall there. The trouble is, I'm just... Uh, trouble with double walling, I'm not going to be able to um, repair... I'm not going to be able to repair the second wall. Uh, so the better option would be to um, just airlock it. And just increase the amount of airlocks so that I have more fail-safes. The issue, of course, with double walling, uh, you can't repair the other side of the double wall. But if I just uh, airlock it like this, throw a door in there, now there's m many points of failure, um, which adds to my security. And I'll just keep doing that. I've already, yeah, as you can see, they broke here, too. Uh, so right now, Nugget should be the only one allowed to traverse around the danger zone. Now I'll have to 
have to keep an eye on him. Yeah, this doesn't have a double wall either. And this doesn't have, really have a fail safe. Self, you know, fail safe either. Oh no, it does. It has a door there. Bit of a beat up door, but a door nonetheless. Would traps work at killing them? Yes, but um, I would need so many, uh, such an unbelievable amount of traps to kill these zombies. Uh, Incendiary ID traps probably would work the best. The trouble is um, having enough fuel to continually hit these zombies with traps uh, because you would need to have some sort of, you know, fuel source. You can't just lighten it, you know, incendiary ID and expect it to, uh, expect it to work. Alright, so the backup door is done. I'm just gonna sneak out here and grab some of the silver that's on the other side, because no one's really watching me. And, uh, Nugget's the only one allowed out. Plus, he's super fast, so if anyone was to see him, be gone. He's got, uh... I know I have another architect leg, but he's got an arctic leg in storage. Alright, so those little zombies never saw me. And now I've got, uh, I've got an airlock. I've got a, a nice airlock, so I can forbid uh, one side of the door and not the other. That will keep me safe. Hola, Demi. Howdy. There's still a hole in the back of my walls. Yeah, there's still holes, like, everywhere. I'm sort of aware of that. I'll be slowly trying to fill it in. I do have to sort of adjust for how dangerous the, um... The new zombies are. I am indeed doing well. So what do you guys think of uh, the new music? Thumbs up, thumbs down, better than uh, better than the RimWorld soundtrack, or did I make it worse? And during nighttime, it's really hard to see where to mine. Sterile materials are done. Um, Bundles monitor would be really, really helpful. Oh, there's our alpaca. Poor little alpaca. Damien, thanks for the bits. I need um, special zombies like the Zombieland mod. Uh, yeah, it's possible that at the end of this series, I will incorporate the Zombielands mod and do another series just like this with Zombielands instead. Uh, I'm totally down for, you know, whatever the community thinks is a, is a good move. Alright, uh, let's ignore roof for everything that is outside of our walls. Ideally, we'd want to remove all the roof. That keeps things more flammable when, um, actually, let's, no, I, I take it back. I'm going to remove roof as much as I can. I want it to be as flammable as possible. Um, well, no, I guess building roof would make it flammable. Yeah, that's something I could do in this tunnel here, is to just build a giant roof and then uh, burn them up. But before I do that, I need Nugget to... Yeah, he's already working over there. Alright, so let's go, I guess, build a roof. Now, this is the only area here where I would consider double walls. Uh, double walls are annoying because, you know, you can't really repair them very easily, but... Um, given how scary those, um, elephants were, uh, I don't want elephant PTSD, so let's double airlock here. I am running a little low on granite, but, um, I'm sure I can find some granite. Cargo pods coming down from Mines of the Forgotten of Medicine. Oh, nice. So where are some there where are some natural granite tiles really just around my prison here this prison is going to get uh, ripped up a bit yeah 
Yeah, elephant PTSD would be a pretty accurate thing. It's just what I currently have. When those elephants came romping in, I was like, uh-oh. Is this the end? Is this what the end looks like? All right, so let's forget that prison. We'll, we'll pick a prison somewhere else. Eh, this could be... Well, that'd be a bad prison. I don't know. Kill box looks nice and cleared. My slug turrets look ready for some fire. Wish it wasn't so rainy, but uh, yeah, we'll open up the gates in just a minute. Put some flooring in front of the uranium slug turrets. Uh, there is, well, so this is all rough sandstone, so I actually do have a fair amount, uh, well, a fair amount of non-flammables. But I will uh, create a little wider of a zone that way. Um, that way, fire can't spread very easily. And uh, another thing I want to do is... I'm doing this so that zombies don't stand on there. Um, actually, maybe just one layer. And that way it will uh, harm the walls less. Do less damage. So once they're done repairing up... I will... Start to fight these things back. Is there a way to check body parts from commands? Probably not. But I can always show you can. So you got a pain stopper and a bionic arm, a uh, old gunshot wound in your torso, and you're a little drunk. Just a little drunk though. We don't even have enough granite to make that yet. Find a cart coming down. This is for can. All right. Nice. We also have the architect leg. I have to pick a target for that as well. Um, so find a cart. Or can and cheese you're gonna get the other architect leg uh i think having someone that's extraordinarily fast comes at a um you know is is very important zarm we'll get you to do the operations for both another architect arm creating out my ashborn's prosthetic for an architect i could do that that would be your right shoulder I think Zarm was like deep in the um, deep in the mines when I ordered that. Queue up some additional steel. Another thing I'm gonna need is the ground penetrating radar. So, uh, well, maybe let's not block. Right there is good. This is sort of just the utilities room. Jeez, you've got two legs. arm is throwing the heart into can and then Ashborn's arm and then I have the old arm too or the old leg rather and we'll we'll figure out who needs the most move speed here we go all of the improvements uh there's a pirate ship passing overhead that's cool Jen you are the person to talk uh let's see here we have a little bit of a chinchilla business, don't we? Uh, Neutramine would be always welcomed. Not something I can locally source. Yayo for sale. Now, I have a lot of lances. Um, that might come in handy. I'm going to sell one of the hearts because we probably don't need two hearts. Um, we have a bonic leg to install. And that's about it. So just more newt. Uh, Tragic Hysteria, thanks for the components. And then a Bionic Leg. So let's do a quick health check here. He's saying, um, having two people that are externally fast would be good. So I'm going to give this leg to you. Um, in, in case I ever need to run interference against uh, like a really, really bad incoming raid, you know, having multiple sp speedy boys. 
very very useful running out there with like doomsday launchers or something like that uh wow that amount of zombies just lagged up my game yeah 73 zombies spawning at once i can see why i'm definitely eager to use these slug turrets soon i'm gonna create a little dump stockpile here for um chunks Stone chunks, and that way we can pull them stone chunks out of the uh, pillbox area, which is not somewhere we really want them to be. Uh, maybe another slug turret. Oh, four zombies from X Games, and these zombies decided to spawn on top of Roblox, which is creating quite. Quite the party, and Crazy Chris sending some wake up. All right, so another uh, here's a Tory Talker event for all of you. Weather. Nah, I'm eager to see the weather change, I'll be honest. Let's uninstall this stuff. And then the last sliver of granite here will mine up that we could use. That's looking good. It's a lot of uranium, but, you know, I value fireproofing what we can. Look at that. Glorious. If only I had a bombardment targeter, that would be easy peasy right there. Alright, so what I'm going to do over here is build a roof over all of this. And that way, uh, if we have a northern breach, uh, we can go ahead and just cook them off. Uh, rather than have to do anything else. Keep them nice and flammable. Crazy Chris, thanks for the bits. What'd you say? No more rain? I love it. Hoping that that wins. And the only issue is I don't want them building the roof from the other side. Let's hope that that doesn't help happen. JD, you are now male. Alright, so we do have deep drilling. I ought to start doing that. Wow, we have like suspiciously no nodes right around the base. There's just a lack of uh, deep drill nodes <laughs> right there. So I'm going to put a drill here and start with one. Rainy thunderstorm. Okay, so you mean just more thunder. Cool. Well, um... Once we roof off everything over here, I think I'm going to open up the option to fight these zombies that are on the map so they don't um, they don't build up so so much. Uh, taking a look at my current meat supply. Oh, there we go. Klein changing to clear weather. All right. So hold fire. Uh, nugget, tea saying, cheese, and Damien. Doesn't seem like clear weather to me. Oh, there we go. I don't know where they're actually trying to fire. Oh, but all these zombies got the message anyway. Look at that swarm. Burn, baby, burn. All right, as promised, uh, I'm gonna restrict to stay home. Corner invasion. Uh, all right, let's get everybody recruited down here. Perfect time bomb.
Animals. Um, Max, you're going to go to Holdor. Holdor needs to be moved. Leave these open. Alright, so some of the weapons I have here, like Sniper Rebels, I really need to start phasing out. I know I've been saying that, but I've been doing a really bad job of doing that. Let's do three more saw rifles. Saw rifles are nice and cheap. Uh, they're not necessarily the strongest weapon I got, but I'll do in a pinch. Uh, Nugget. I'm out of uranium. Um, hmm. <laughs> I'm going to temporarily just build a wall there so that I don't have a big back door into my base. Uh, whatever happened to my deep drill? Is it... Uh, Oh, you haven't built it yet. Alright, come, come on, hold our rat. Oh, there he is. Max, it was nice knowing you. The Dr. Kevorkian door. Yep, that is exactly what it is. Come on, Max. A little further. All right, well, that door opening works. Uh, power music sending nine uranium, thanks. And the flood. Oh, man, I feel like it really is the flood, isn't it? Nugget, okay, let's pop these doors open and then get queued for the fight. All right, Ashborn, I'm sending you back. Cheese, I'm sending you forward. Uh, you all are down fighting. Uh, okay, so I got a group of pirates landing on top of me. So as much as I wanted to fight the zombies, I can't. That was the invasion you all voted for. Crew, you brain damaged idiot. Bet he's so slow. All right, this is going to be a little weird. There's not... You know what? Actually, there's a bunch of furniture, but I, I don't feel super comfortable hiding behind furniture to not get shot. But I don't really see... Oh, that's a frag grenade. Move, Damien, move! Okay, so they didn't come through there. Um, well, I'm going to turn these off because they're not good at close range. This was supposed to be left open. Leave this open. She's fall back. Oh, you're going to try to get stabbed. Well, good luck with your architect arm. I'm going to forbid all of the doors that could lead me to zombies. This is gold. Interesting. True, you must have killed him. Let's push up, put the fire out. Cheese just murdered that guy. Gal, whatever it was. Uh, my dear, uh, well, hold on. Let me, um, let me just celebrate this. Yeah, there we go. That is the pop proper face. Okay, um, this is fine. Actually, you know what? This is fine Should, would be a lot better, wouldn't it? There we are. This is fine. Well, soon that battery is going to go kaplamo. So, what did you do to the... Oh, time bomb. That's not good. I forgot about Time Bomb because he's pacifist. 
Uh, so they set the barracks on fire. Uh, they're trying to bash their way out. Let's go ahead and encourage them to die quicker. Two bunnies trying to raid the, uh, the hospital. Alright, time bomb, you're not looking so healthy. Let me get some firefighting capabilities out here. Casty, would you help through? have any fire foam poppers so architect work yeah you're all set to fight fires right now but you're kind of not there we go I reset that oh those morons are going to let the zombies in so I gotta get there quick Jimmy here is um well, he sort of set himself on fire. Uh, so here's what I'm going to do over here. Is, uh... Destruct. Ashborn. Oh, you can destruct that. Alright, that, uh, raider died. Stop cowering, start fighting fires. Alright, uh, Ken, I'm going to make you a worker here. Break that so we can actually put the fires out in there, because otherwise we won't be able to enter. Now we have a whole bunch of people trying to get to Time Bomb. Hasty is rescuing Time Bomb. Uh, let me go ahead and allow all. Let's keep doing the this is fine thing, so as you all know. Alright, so a lot of burns there, but um, otherwise, okay. McGurkin. Trying to select you and not rice. Yes. Go ten. Alright, Jen, let's go murder Jimmy. Uh drug lab in there is not looking so good. Ambrosia sprouts, thanks, JFK. I will look at that later. Alright, Cheese murdered the people that were trying to break out. Wow, that is an inferno. I think I could probably... Well, I can't even select it, so I'm not even going to worry about it. Alright, can you just murder Jim? Oh, Jimmy broke the door. Uh-oh. That's going to be a big old explosion there. Can't stop that. Chain explosion! Alright, let's kill Jimmy. Jimmy's dead. And... What are you guys doing? Uh, so one thing I want to do is the assignments. How do I do this? Hmm. I want to change the reaction to hostilities. Yeah, here we are. Uh, ignore. That way they stop cowering. Alright, so the farm is safe. Uh, TX. Oh, someone's sending something because I can't do anything. Yep, Pop Rock sent in a bunch of zombies. Every time that happens, I lag up a lot. Alright, so I think this is a, uh, this here is a lost cause. So I'm going to not bother fighting the fires in there. I'm just going to let it rip. And I'll uninstall the one bed there. Quarters hall. Yo. All right. 
Cleansing fire. Yep, clear it all out. Try to save the emanator. The emanator is inflammable, so I don't even need to save it. Oh, so the last... Okay, so they are already spreading. Let's turn this off. This is the group of new zombies. Uh, so let's see. Colonists need treatment. Dev. Um, geez, I'm going to have you tend to yourself. And nobody's going to get meds for the moment. We're just going to patch everyone up real quick. Oh, the sounds of fire. Uh, tend, tend, tend. Time bomb's already tended up. All sorts of fire alerts. Oh, the zombies spread it to this turret. That's the problem, is they, like, walk over and they spread it. Um... And uranium slug turrets are not... The flammability is a bit different. Uh, so who else? Tadpole needs treatment too. Alright, definitely going to want to invest in a less than flammable uh, barracks for the future. What do I have a lot of? I've got a lot of steel and slate. Flooring. Slate tiles. Well, AC. Not gonna say it will be easy to fix it up, but what choice do we have but to try? Definitely could work on fire foam poppers, for sure. It's funny that that's the one time it wasn't raining, right? Uh, beer coming down from Light Void. Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, so, even though it's raining, the turret still blew up, because that makes sense. We have a lot of cleanup to do, so I'm going to keep those doors closed. Uh, I don't really care about the gold. At, let's see what's over here. I'll label it as gold, but... Pretty low on the priority of things to do. Alright, so that's gold. This is over here. Uranium. Good. Found some uranium. Maybe make those zombies into biofuel. Um, yeah, I don't really have a bio refinery right now, but if I did, I would. Uh, we do have a butcher creature here, so let's see. Someone that's really, really fast. Uh, Nugget, I'm gonna make this with you. So I need material. Why? Zombie. What? Oh, because they're behind forbidden doors, maybe. See if that was it. Nope, need material. Hmm. This butcher creature doesn't seem to work at all. I don't know why. Um, Nugget. Where are you, Nugget? Your work priority. Oh, you can't even craft. Never mind. Ashborn. Let's see if you can do it. Still need material. Yeah, there's something wrong with this uh, butcher table. Yeah, it could be with the zone restriction. Up, oh, but more zombies are spawning. Um, Alright, so before they spawn up and become a problem, let me close these doors. Change the restriction to stay home. Just fr from stay home to stay close. More uranium coming in from Cyborg. Chimp. Alright, forbidding the doors there. And we'll get this all 
repaired, upgraded, etc. Let's save some power. We got some more little chinchillas. That's good. Happy little suicidal chinchillas. As far as slate goes, I'm going to want to stone cut a whole lot of slate. Let's see if there's any, um, no, there doesn't seem to be any slate instructions, but there is slate out here. We're gonna want a lot of sleep blocks. Yeah, these zombies know exactly where they want to be going. All right, so we have some zombie meat coming out. Uh, cremate corpse. So, rotten zombies, rotten animals, and rotten or fresh humans. All right, that seems about right. Seems accurate. Uh, work. True, you are going to... Oh, no, not true. Damien, you're going to be... You're a miner. Uh, Witsy. Let's see. Not assigned to cook. Oh, it's a cooking task. Okay. Darm. That's you. Yeah, that's right. It would be a cooking task. Chem fuel coming down from Palans. Wood from Crazy Chris. Hyperweave from Space. And new area revealed. Um. Cool. Uh, there's even more new area behind there, isn't there? I could see it. Oh, that was uninteresting. Medicine from X Games. Oh, that's looking a little bit better in there. Definitely getting repaired up. All right, uranium mine is going. Don't really have any turrets protecting it or anything like that, so I might come to regret that soon. And then this door really needs to get put back. Well. Oh, the uh, barracks coming along. That's not so bad. Oh, found some natural uranium. Look at that. Lucky me. Uh, the corpse crem crematorium is not um, cooking zombie corpses, only rotten ones. I already just checked that. So, unless they have many different bills. Yes, see, they are not taking it over here. This only cooks uh, rotten zombie corpses, which don't yield anything we want anyway. All's well. Uh, I'm not gonna ever build uh, bedrooms. We just have too many people. Way too many people to consider that. Too much to house. If I was to build bedrooms, I'd have to basically kill off maybe two-thirds of everyone to afford it space-wise. So, either I kill off two-thirds of everyone or I don't build it. I think everybody knows what people want out of there. So, um, Allison Crunk, you should be getting this, right? Alice. Oh, is Crunk not? Oh, okay, no, never mind. Dead. Who was the who was the couple we had? Oh. Ex lover. Oh it, okay. 
brother. Maybe we didn't really have one. I'm not going to build bedrooms in the mountain, either. That's just inviting infestation swarms. In a really terrible way. It's going to be barracks. It's going to stay barracks. There's not, not... Not anything to convince me otherwise. I'll put it like that. In fact, there's not even really a penalty to barracks if your ba barracks is impressive enough. Uh, and the, I can assure you, the bedrooms would never be more impressive and more of a, a mood buff than the, um, than the alternative. Alright, so Cheese is working on the, uh, biorefinery. Or something. Uh, Nugget, I'm gonna have you construct this. Uh, a lot of this meat here is going to spoil, so it is important to start to, uh, process it. Which is a craft skill... So, Damien, I'm going to have you... Oh, yeah. Uh, make chem fuel from organics. Use only zombie meat. And Damien, for your work... Oh, we are going to need to make these simple meals again. I am down to pack of survivals. And our kid fuel's going back up. That's a weird place to sleep. Oh god. It always scares me when so I mean, it should be safe, because I did build it to be safe, but it always scares me if someone goes out there. Alright, so for now, uh, I'm going to set up temporary sleeping spots, and then I'll slowly fill in uh, proper bedding. What's going on with this slagger? Why aren't people um, processing? Let's see, craft. Ashborn, you like crafting. Anyone that likes crafting, I'm just going to set them on to one. We are getting our chem fuel back. At least we set the chem fuel up so that it wouldn't, you know, blow up anything else. It chained together, but like, at some point that's a little inevitable. But we did prevent a lot of otherwise would have been terrible damage. Nugget. Chat event, clear weather, thanks. All right, so here is the start of bedding again. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do is, what are we set to stay close? All right, so everyone's gonna be set to stay, no, stay close works. Everyone's going to stay on Stay Close, but they're not going to be allowed here. Nugget, you're the only one that's going to be allowed here. That way I'm not competing. Uh, more zombies coming in. Thanks, Storyteller. Oh, a bunch of foxes. Wood coming down from Cabassia. Whole lot of it. Big old bucket. Uh, so this is a masterwork bed. That's pretty awesome. And the good ones are going to get broken down. I know about the mods that do this. Don't worry, every time I do this, if someone links the mods. I'm aware. I'm aware. Good. Excellent. Okay, there's another excellent one. Good. Alright, uranium coming down. Fireproof beds for future disasters. Um, I'll just put in a, uh, I will have a, uh, fire foams in there. But the thing is, even with the, um, now that I have, uh, 
the f the ground's not flammable, that that will make a significant difference. Cause that honestly was the problem. Was we it was just all flowers. Another Lago, and more zombies from Witsy. Oh, looking at the current weather, Witsy. Gonna have you man this mortar. We are gonna set fire over here. Good first hit. Nugget, you want to go out here to build a roof? Fine. That's going to be hard to rehouse everybody, but we'll get it done in due time. And here is your chance at voting on another event. Hopefully one that uh, that doesn't reset us back to, like, the Stone Age. But that's up to you. Enough, Witsy, thank you. Where is Nugget going? I have to kind of babysit Nugget because uh, he's the only one unrestricted. VTech, that was not an option for sleeping. I like how Damien jumped in the comfortable bed. Alright, Nugget. If you need food, I'm gonna give you a survival meal. Get you back to work. Vitals monitor's done. That's very cool. Um, advanced fab would be very good. False munition would be awesome. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, build copy. That's what it is. Alright, Nugget wants to go to sleep. And we got a mad monkey. That's what got voted on. Okay. Add monkey funky monkey time. Alright, I'll let him sleep. Still, a bunch of people sleeping on the ground, but uh, we'll make that change soon. Here comes some rain. Put out the swarms of zombies. I can see, well, actually we're low on power for a entirely different reason. Neuro Neuromech training for Damien. For cooking. Alright. Damien. Said it was for your pond, but you had a cooking of one. Mad chinchilla. There goes the monkey. Mad monkey already dead. Alright, Nugget. So I'm moving it over here so that other people can move it elsewhere. I like how T-Sang's right in the thoroughfare. With the most disturbed sleep possible. Alright, so these beds, we'll get them installed. Uh, the 
Barracks is coming along. Well, I'll wait for them to wake up before I start moving them. Uh, good. Good. Excellent. Good. Excellent. Excellent. Good. zombies around. A little tempted to clean them out and maybe start hunting. Alright, so these beds need to get set up. Then I'm actually going to get some sort of a head count. Figure out how many beds I need, how many I don't have to set up. Another thing I need to do, which is pretty clear, is to uh, continue my slate mining. Because we're not yet tiled up. I guess I can turn this whole zone into some sort of resource extraction area. Even if there's overhead mountain, I don't really care. We're going to want the materials. Alright, Nugget. We'll get you to break down those beds. Yet another one. Come on, put a little bit more care into your work, and I won't have you doing this so much. Right, this is looking pretty good. We still have a lot of slag left, don't we? Oh man, everything you're making is terrible. Nugget, what, what happened to your quality, man? So as far as I know, I don't have anyone in a, in a couple right now, right? So let's see, I have 19 beds and 25 people. I'm not quite there yet. Still have a little bit more to go. Twenty. Wow, dude. Wow, they're getting worse. What is going on? Alright, so casey has been making the Asa rifles. At least they are decent. Um, let's see here. Crew. Let's get you equipped with that. Eh, it's actually kind of waste on you. Ashborn will have you take it. I'm still waiting on True's, um, to, to sort of fix his permanent mood. It's been a long time coming. Alright, there's another one. That's 21 out of 25. Oh, we have 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, so two more. Nugget, you're very, very close. Yet you taunt me with your inability to crank them out. Come on, man. Oh, God, why? You're 20, uh, 17 skill. This is embarrassing. I suck at woodworking. I could make better beds. Well, if you ever wanted to waste an entire uh, mountain of steel, here you go. This is the fastest way to do it. Trust a nugget to do a man's job. Um... Or woman's job. There we go. I think that's that's what we're waiting on. It's 
still, the barracks are a bit of a mess, but it's uh, it's getting improved bit by bit. Alright, eh, I don't care where they sleep. Food bin, sure, yes. Barracks is awful. But that's somewhat your fault, buddy, because you wouldn't make a nice one. There we go. Alright, so now we just need the slate blocks. Uh, and that I can require Time Bomb to craft up, so let's just make slate. Not a lot of zombies left on the map here, so come morning time, I think it's uh, time to wipe out zombos. Maybe do some hunting to supplement our simple meals that have been um, definitely a pain point for a lot of the people. I guess there was a steel bed out here that was excellent. Now it's up to decent, and it should be going up and up and up as we continue. Mediocre. I'm not going to assign anyone beds, I'm just going to clear it all. Okay, uh... Who do we got here? Animals. Chilla one, go out to Hodor. Mm. Zombies coming in, just from the storyteller. Oh god, that's not good. Nugget was unrestricted, and that's going to become a problem immediately. Very much immediately, as his torso was the first to get hit. So he just has, what, one... Uh, I should just keep it a... Ch oh boy, I don't want to get slugged either. Uh, restrict. Stay home. Mr. Nugget. This is the uh, the punishment for being a terrible constructor when we wanted those beds. I had to go through like 300 beds. So McGurkin, go stand over him looming. Steel coming down from, uh, okay, that yeah, works. Let the message test. All right, let's tend to Mr. Nugget. Of course, the torso is always the first thing to get bit. Um, save the chinchilla. Yes, I could save the chinchilla. All right, McGurkin. to save my uh, ammo here. Drew, you're still working on your wake-up tolerance. Soon, soon, someday, my friend. That will get cleared. Uh, Witsy, or Happy, you're right here. And this mortar, it happens not to be... time. Hopefully that fire spreads. It isn't right now. Uh, McGurkin sending some more zombies my way who are tearing up the local animals. 
Oh, Nugget's shirt got torn up. All right, another thing I want to do is to continue mining steel because I just wasted a whole lot of it putting the uh, barracks back. Thanks for the fire warnings continually. They are totally not annoying. Uh, yes, so I have sterile tiles for the hospital. That's another thing I should probably queue up. Uh, floors, sterile tile. Uh, so I don't think I'm going to keep the hospital here. This hospital is going to move somewhere else if I'm going to sterilize the flooring. Um... The issue is, it's not really clear where I should put it. Yeah. Don't forget the episode goal. Yeah, well, I've been mining up a storm up here, so I haven't forgotten about the uh, increased cave mines. Uh, I've been mining like crazy, in fact. Uh, so let's start make. Let's start mining shafts to look for uh, other materials. So this is mostly, this is wide enough to look for steel, but not really other stuff unless we happen upon it. Because small nodes like silver, gold, etc. are uh, obviously a lot smaller. Right. As far as the airlock goes, let's keep them out of the airlocked gapped areas. We are now mining up the tunnels. Good. A whole lot of zombies. And unfortunately, like, their meat or chem fuel or leather or whatever kind of goes to waste when we butcher them like that. But, you know, oh well. It's cheaper to set them on fire. Look at all the... Um, Zombie leather that I have. Oh boy. I need to have some way to deal with that. Witsy and Zarm. Let's switch guns. I do have a power claw. I don't know if anyone needs it though. Let's see if we have any like missing fingers. Chocolate coming down from Hez. Really need it. Not yet. Nope, I don't have any missing fingers. Alright, this should become a home zone again because it's not being cleaned. And the impressiveness is going up as a result. We're now in the extremely impressive range, which is good. Damn it. So, the problem with fire is it's always messing up my slug turrets. Uh. Right, restrict. one caught him in the lung. Ah, oh, and there's an, an, an enemy here. There's a chinchilla. Alright, chinchilla's dead. Uh, yes. So I'm gonna have to close these uranium doors anytime I use the, uh... Anytime I use the turrets or fire to clear this out. Well, Damien, uh, you're in need of a lung. I think I have one, though. That's... It's annoying, but not that bad of an issue. Install lung. Alright, and then I need, uh... Let's, let's just stop advanced fabs and go straight for fire foam. That's just continually an annoying problem that we've been facing. So I think these slug turrets are probably best used against um, raiders. 
Whereas the regular turrets and maybe auto turrets for zombies, I would probably say just regular turrets for zombies. Jeez, sorry to wake you up. I'm gonna have you do a little bit of a uh, lung replacement. Now the reason why, um, Hendrik, I don't really want to use the mountain zones for anything is infestations. Um, when I'm already fighting zombies on one front, if I have um, if I have infestations on another other front, I'll divide my attention and it, it will go wrong. It always, always, always does split attention like that. Alright, so if you check the numbers here, yeah, this is the only tortoise. Alright, so this is a unique opportunity to do some hunting. So I'm going to hunt boomalopes and capybaras. And, you know, I'm just going to hunt everything. I don't care what it is. Man, there's a really healthy biome here. It's kind of ridiculous. Oh, there's rhinos. You know, maybe I'll hunt rhinos first, because that will be the most net of um, food. Boomalopes. I'll start with the rhinos. Uh, as far as who can hunt, let's see, numbers. Colonists, move speed. So if I'm hunting rhinos, it needs to be someone that's fast. So, cheese. Um... He's saying you two can hunt. Uh, who else? Can Alice JD? Can where are you? There you are, Alice JD. Gotta be able to outrun that. Oh, but you all decided to send me some zombies instead. So, uh, let's see what I can do about that. I am going to deny that. go. I'm using the uh, psychic animal pulser so that the animals come to fight me. And Elmer Man sending me a manhunter pack. So uh, we're gonna have a lot of lot of animals coming in to the uh, into the base here. And my hope is that the animals outrun the zombies. This is gonna be interesting. Oh, and more zombies spawning because lag. No brain. Sending some as well. Oh, it made my own animals go crazy. My bad. Kind of forgot about that uh, result here. Zero is getting all sorts of beat up by uh, chickens. Bet you feel a little bit like Link right now, don't you? Zero is tanking so that Tadpole and uh, Pat can run away. Well, he's going to be a doctoring nightmare. Uh, what I should have done is I should have locked them up in the... Uh... Oh, Zarm's up there too. I should have locked them up first. Alright, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'll have to deal with the, uh, the animals up there later. And the people that are going to be stuck with them. So Chemfuel coming down. We'll power that on. Damien. Young. These should be closing. I'm going to start punching back. Right, why isn't this not powering on? Oh, because there's a missing part of it. Uh, Ashborn. We'll build that quick. And it's lagging once again. Oh, it's a bit of a bash up up there. Now, where are you, Ash? You're heading down. Cheese, I'm gonna have you stick around trying to rescue people. His arm's finally down, but he doesn't have a lot of bleed out time. Zero's getting there. Oh, 
I'm gonna try to turn these off before. I didn't realize there was this many um giant creatures. I call them. Oh, that slug turret can't even turn off. All right, we'll blow up on them then. It's yielded a little bit of food, but not a lot. Oh, these rats can walk right out? Okay. Let's deal with that situation right now. Go save the people we can. Kill the animals that turned on us. These animals are always for sacrifice anyway. So they're just sacrificing themselves a little earlier. Alright, Pat. Nope, cheese don't take that shot. Alright, Zarm's getting rescued. Zero's gonna be next. This is like, uh... It'll be interesting. Alright, these naughty animals I'm just gonna leave there. We're at a lack of meat anyway, so it's a perfect opportunity to turn them into meat. Let's see. No medical care. In the fight of zombies versus animals, I'm thinking the uh, zombies are winning. Fortunately, that means that um, these turrets are free to fire again. I think you're going to need to do an emergency surgery in a second. At. Down. Can't wait for his uh, wake up tolerance to dip. Damien can now walk. He's gonna want to join us down here, I'm sure. Drops get patched up. Zero. You need to get patched up too. Um, Gherkin, you're gonna. Yeah, you're already ten. Minutes. Good. So uh, I suspect that pretty much none of these animals are gonna be viable food sources. Unfortunately, that's just the way it is sometimes. But they're so attracted to the noise of the turrets, they have not yet paid much attention to me. Let's see, how are we doing here? They're being patched up. We have a bit of an eye scar. Uh, there is a lot of little cuts on Zero, though. It's going to take a while to patch those up. Chemfuel, here are some explosions. Thank you. Uh, Doomsday rocket launcher from Hendrick. Nice. And let me clear out some of these. So, survival meals from Night Divinity and chem fuel from Polans. I think I already read the chem fuel nugget. You need food. Uh, Dev. Go feed. No, okay. Dev, guess what? You are a level four doctor. Go feed nugget. Alright, as you can see, some of the animals are already coming back from the dead. 
some of them, um, yeah, well, we'll, we'll see. see how that works out. Is out. So Zero and Zarm. Zarm is okay. Zero is the one I'm actually worried about because he has so many teeny little cuts that it's hard to patch him. And then there's also Tadpole. Tadpole goes to the hospital. All of my naughty little animals are gonna get left there. Maybe I'll uh, end up adding some animals. But I can tell you right now, that's probably not gonna be the case. Given that I've got 200 zombies and that's my primary focus. TX, you should go get yourself an LMG. Not this dainty little uh, sniper rifle that you're sporting. Dev, you're fully healed. Good. Get an LMG and come on down. Some of these turrets are pretty bashed up. I'm going to turn them off as a result. I'll keep that. Some of the uh, animals that turned on me are dying. Oh, good. All right, Zarm, you're out of the woods, bleeding-wise. Cheese, switch targets. That minigun's still up now. Of course, that minigun burned. Hmm. Excuse me. I think you see a need for fire here. Lifetime supply of fuel if I could get through the group there. Cheese, I'm going to have you switch to zero. McGurkin, switch to Tadpole. Cheese, you're just faster at it, and zero needs better doctoring than it's currently being offered. I don't even know how many... Bot BF, okay. I'm going to leave it paused while the bot reloads. Tadpoles almost all patched back up. Four zombies coming from VTech. Of elk. I prefer when it has like strong zombies that aren't so numerous. The spam of many, many, many zombies. Really kind of annoying. Um, time bomb. Level up. Uh in medicine. That's good. Being the pacifist and all. It'd be good to have you dock. All right, zero is being patched up faster now. Uh, that was the right choice. Much as I'd want cheese down here shooting zombies, his talents are also sometimes required elsewhere in our in-house medic. Game's getting a little laggy. Medicine coming down from Wits. And blondes died. Yeah, okay. So if you take a look at allow, there's 305 things that I needed to allow. My guess is most of those are zombies. Proto, I will actually give you care, because I'm going to sacrifice you to the door god soon. Looks like a lot of my turrets are running out of ammo, so the few that are still somehow attacked, I will uh, power on and have fire. Nugget, Zarm, Tadpole, you should go rest. Zero, you're going to survive this. That was noisy. 
easy. Um, all right, who of you guys? V, go, J, Pat, more Jen, Quitsy. Anyone that is risking a mood, uh, actually, let's have everyone take a break for a moment. I'm going to restrict to stay home. All right, that's already done. Because they're all going to need a meal break. Uh, more zombies coming in. Another 59. I'm going to turn these turrets off because they're almost broken. Jeez, you are so busy patching Zero up, you need to go eat. Um, the Gherkin, you finish up the tending. So why is this veg here not not causing them to haul it? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Now it's done. All right, so there's a little piece of the stay home zone that was uh, inappropriate. There we go. Done. Hey, look. More people to the party. Zero is still getting patched up. How's my money type? The mining tunnels yielding. We have not found squat yet. It looks like. All yeah, right, that's fine. As long as work is being done. So that eye scratch is just going to get healed by the Luciferium eventually. We don't really need to worry about that so much. Is the max number of skills... I think you mean traits. Uh, four. Yes, it is. Four is indeed the max. For, for traits. Right, that broken bed was bothering me. Uh, four... What am I doing? A uh, dresser. Maybe I'll I'll have some sort of rhyme or reason behind this. Um, what material do I have a lot of? Blocks, uh, sandstone, I guess. Uh, dressers. Out of sandstone. Cover most of the beds. 25 wake up from um, Peter or something. I'm sorry. I'm really bad with um, games like that. Oh, we got a good old fashioned social fight. Gen 1. No surprise there, given that she's got uh, got them sniper eyes. Uh, wow, Witsy. Dang. That is a lot of bits. Dropping it because you felt like it. I love it. Happy is now female. Um, I'm going to leave these sandstone dressers unfinished and have uh, Nugget finish them off when he is awake. Hasty. There's nothing to smith or tailor. That is uh, hard to believe. Really? Oh, well, that's true. Um, hmm. I guess that might be true. Luciferium from Fangface, running a little low. Here's some more. Thanks. That'll keep us going. Inspiration. Shoot accuracy for TX. Shoot frenzy. Uh, gender swap for happy. Increase skill for Mord of shooting. Maybe I'll just let Ashborn finish these up. 15 to 17 is not that big of a difference. Alright, 
wood from Witsy. Thanks, Witsy. Let's clear all this. Jen, you need treatment. Oh, yeah, 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 the social fight. Maybe having Zarm do it is a bad idea, because he's a little hurt himself. Oh, wow, dub. Bulk goods is probably the best thing I could ask for, because we have so much in the stockpile right now that needs to get uh, removed. So, Nugget, you need new priorities. I don't I guess you're the artist, too. Uh, let's see, Warden. Dan, I'm going to have to wake you up. Run a little low on power, too. Um, so, we killed off a lot of our pets. And part of me thinks that I should get the farm going again. So let's get a tomcat with some female cats. Uh, yeah. And hopefully uh, the... Nope. Okay, yep, that happened last time. They just... Bye-bye, cats. Short, 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 short-lived cats. Can let's get you back on the uh, a Balkan Strader. Pat's no longer chemical interested. I'm gonna forbid these doors. All right, well that sucked. Uh, zombie leather. And what can we buy? That is wow. They have a ton of muffler wool. I don't know why they would carry so much, but that's interesting. Well, let's see what we need. Uh, chinchilla fur, I can pa part with. Actually, all of my little leathers I can part with because um, they're not they're not big enough stacks to bother keeping. Uh, I'm super interested in buying plasteel, but that's kind of the I want to get on a spaceship and get out of here. Me talking. Now, we have a lot of clothing. So the cloth pants that are excellent and the shirts that are good, I'll keep. Got duster, good, keep. These things sell. Sell. All right, so now we've, uh, we're not broken even yet, but uh, I could take a look to see if there's anything I want to buy. Cloth, potentially. And maybe that's about it. Uh, and cat meat. Hope the cat meat doesn't land in the wrong spot. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Oh, good, good. I'm so glad that I was able to donate cat meat to my kill box. Uh, yep, we don't even have a roof over here, and yet these things miss constantly. Well, at least we got the cloth. Mord is now a jogger. Well, some of the meat we have, but not all the meat. In terms of things I could turn off, let's go turn off the fat bench and the smithy. We're not using it. I've definitely been having some power shortage issues lately. Uh, we do have fire foam research. That's really, really good. Uh, Multi-barrel weapons would be awesome against zombies, I think. Now, it's going to be really, really hard to uh, have ammo left in them. Let's fire off the last of the ammo. It'd be really difficult to uh, clear out these zombies here safely. Because they are camping the doors pretty close. Alright, so as far as a fire foam popper goes, let's see here. Get a popper set up there. That one up here. There. Side. Hmm. Here. One inside here. Oh, can't do it. A lot of poppers, but we've had a lot of fires. More steel coming down from tea drank. Oh, my poor cat meat. Look at all the wounded people. Mr. Cheese, I got a job for you. 
We'll use this wonderfully donated Doomsday. Let's see about this. I want to target a corpse. Fire in the hole, guys. I cleared some of them out. Oh, they got real pissed. And they're smashing up my door. Alright, Mord, now that you're Jugger. Uh, Ashborn, you're close. Let's see if we can't salvage that door there. And we can. A bunch of these doors at 50%. I'd like to salvage them as well. Still coming down from Bree Dog. All right, so I think what I'm going to do in just a moment here, 9 a.m. once people are fully up, I'm going to have them um, start to uh, clear the remainder of these zombies. Okay, it's still out. Oop, APO, I didn't mean to leave you like that. Uh, let's see. True, are you over your chem? Nope, 98%. 2% short of what you need to be. Yeah, I do need a secondary temp zone, storage, etc. That's something I'll, I'll think about doing in the future. Open up the gates. And close the gates. Yeah, with no turrets firing. Uh, it doesn't... They definitely get drawn quickly. Uh, let's see here. Gonna go... Close this door behind me. Hop out there. True, actually, you, you need to get lost, buddy. Me, no offense, but you're way too slow to do your chem damage to your brain. Uh, of this group. Ow. Would you be going around like that? Uh, who is constructs here? Obviously, I'm gonna need to replace that. And wants to go for some food. Come on, there we go. Box is closed. So if I clear out all these zombies, I can start breaking this down. I can claim all that cat meat. The important stuff. as a psycho addiction. I uh... Okay, so no drugs for you. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? Social drugs. No longer use wake up. There we go. Fixed. 
Don't forget Ashbourne's restriction. Yep. I got it. Thanks for the uh, reminder, Witsy. Alright, numbers. Enemies, zero. None at all. Alright, lift, lift. Uh, we'll leave that forbidden. Uh, restrictions. Everybody's unrestricted now. We have a lot of cleanup, fix, etc. to do. And good, bad, bad. Okay, that's not good. I should probably get this meat somewhere safe, quick, because things go from good to bad really, really quickly in this community. And it's playing sad music already, so that gives me some sort of uh, auditory cue that uh, nothing stays nice. But you're all voting for good, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe. All right, well, at least we have some food. Bye-bye, Valkos Trader. It was a pleasure. And I managed to grab the uh, cat meat, which is awesome. We have some rebuilding to do. Learn my lesson. Don't set fires around my turrets. Nugget. You have psychosis? Not yet. Good. Everyone unrestricted, you say. Gush tired being a, a big old meanie. Alright, let's restrict to stay close. Because the time bomb is not abiding. Oh wow, they uh they broke some walls here. Interesting. Um, okay, so... Ash, do, do, do. Alice, Alice, Alice. You are going to be our nighttime constructor. Going over here. Zombunnies, yes, Ashborn. Indeed, Zombunnies coming. Messing with us. Wild boar self-tamed, cool. Uh, you are going to go to pets. I think you all know what I'm going to do to him, but still... Alright, so this was a big hole in the base. Now it is all walled up. Uh, here's the bunnies. And the boar can't get through because the bunnies. Nope, boar dead. Alright, Mr. Boar. Much as I would have liked your pig. Pig meat. Not this time. So what have we been adding that is requiring so much, um, power? I don't know. But what I will do is, anyone that has any passion for cooking, I will allow to cook. Uh, and then what I'll do is I'll restrict the meals that we have for 10+. plus. And that way the other cooks can butcher zombies. Uh, and then actually this butcher creature will be 10 plus and this mate kibble will be 10 plus and that way we have cooks that um, will help out but you know yeah, it will be far less of a problem another thing I'd like to oh well uh, some of the power needs are from all the auto doors man I can't even turn these turrets off very easily Really see that I even have turrets. All right, and now we have uh, more chem fuel coming out. Crematoriums are still on. Yeah, I am actually going to need them on. Uh, well, I don't need. I'll keep one on. Big old turrets coming back. How about my pets? Animals. So we got Friday and Margarita. 
Uh, unfortunately, they're both female. And then the chinchilla, Proto Eden, that is going to be our door, door opener. Uh, these crematoriums don't. The only so I already went through the bills. They don't actually cremate uh, non or non rotten zombies. So there's no way that the crematorium is removing fuel. As you can see, no one's currently using it. In fact, new material is a great proof of concept there. Um, yeah, this butchery is going full time. Unfortunately for small creatures, which is kind of a waste of time, but this butchery is going full time. So yeah, the, the crematorium is all set up to not take materials that I, uh, I need, which is good. Yeah, I had thought of that though. Good that I wasn't the only one. Uh, what is this, more zombies? Oh no, that's from the old zombie sending. Zero scratch, just healed up. Luciferium got the scar before he even healed up from all of the little nicks and wounds. Kind of funny. Uh, true, you're probably 99%. Alright, you're almost, almost ready to get your chem damage healed. I'm excited. Yes, use commands for the commands chat. I know they might be allowed in here. Uh... There are some settings I need to tinker with, but uh, that doesn't necessarily mean I want to get the our public chat, you know, spammed up or whatever. All right, so we have a whole lot. Oh, Nugget, you're on your feet. Good, good, good. Let's give you an assault rifle. Zero, uh, you're conscious. You should rest up, but I'm going to give you an assault rifle. Zarm, you too, as well. Let's get you an assault rifle. Pat, you're the only one that doesn't have a weapon right now that needs one. Uh, let me make one more saw rifle, I suppose. And these other cues for stuff I can get rid of. Uh, the extra rooms will be closed in a few days. Yes, Twitch wasn't lying about that. So what we're going to do is uh, I'll set up the bot to take whispers instead. More zombies coming from Elm. And there goes the biome. Ooh, just hit compact machinery, though. And some additional steel. Oh, a lot of additional steel. I wasn't actually given the uh, the alert about that. Yeah, I don't, I don't exactly know why Twitch feels the need to um, remove the rooms. Probably to make their tech less expensive. Alright, so most of these zombies are starting to rot. As you can see, they're all turning. But we got a, a fair bit of um, zombie meat and um, chem fuel out of them. So, not a waste. I think it might be about time for me to start clearing out new waves of zombies. Yeah, look, look at them turning brown. Sweeping across. Oh, clear weather. I love it. Will I use new patches of this? I don't think there are new patches. Merlin Kane sending me some Helmex serum. Thanks. Or use old patches. I, I, I'm not aware of any new patches to this mod, but I can take a look. APO purchasing great memory. And now, McGurkin. You're usually healing stuff, but what about burning stuff? I'm going to use the forbid tool to make sure that nobody is um, hauling anything in here because I'm about to set it all on fire. And maybe... Oh, that was a perfect shot. Should have you do that more often. Um, happy pants. Maybe butcher the... Oh, Nugget's already got it. I unforbid some rather large, fresh corpses so that we can get some meat out of it. I was like, geez, where are you going? <laughs> uh, I have so much PTSD from stuff like that. All right, I can power these doors down when I'm not using them. Uh-oh. We have a lot of people that have psychic addictions. 
I am not entirely sure why. I did schedule them safely, but I don't know. They must have abused it at some point. Kind of not my problem. Uh, okay, beating fire out. Let's, instead of changing the, uh, the home zone, we'll just get rid of firefight. And then soon we'll send one of the, uh, the cats to open up the door. Uranium coming down from Elm, thanks. Bunch of idle colonists. Yeah, and they're even in the tunnels here. Grow trees when I have time. Uh, yeah, I could definitely start to add some grow tree zones. Would be a terrible idea. The the, the issue is um the quality of the uh, the quality of the soils kind of sucks. I'll be blunt about that. So like, if I did a grow tree, eh, let's do a giant grow tree zone here. Um, let's plant. Oh, I don't even have the tech, so that's a moot point. Once I get the tech, I can set that up. Definitely hit a big old steel node here. Some compacted machinery there. More steel. Make sure that everyone that is... Okay, every... We have so many miners. It, no, they're all decent at it. All right, now that we've burned up just about the last of these corpses, I can uh, go ahead and allow all so that the ones that aren't on fire get put away. And then we'll open up the front gates and get shooting. All right, building another failsafe wall. And door. Check their age, Gustard mentions, about uh, if they're younger. He's 25, so he shouldn't have had any problems there. Uh, but yeah, if they have a smaller body, that means their metabolism's a little bit different, and they have a different recovery time from drugs. I don't think I have anyone underage anymore. Um, I believe that's true. Uh, what would this be? Records age or something? Stats age? I don't really know how to get age... Oh, here it is. Age. Uh, we do have one 17-year-old. Zero. Um, but he has Luciferium. So he's already a young drunk addict. Uh, right here, I was planning on putting uh, artifacts. Or rather, um, maybe serums. Alright, I would say we're just about ready to open up the Hellgate to London. Pat, you need a gun. McGurkin, you need a gun. Our right, animals. Chinchilla to the whole door. What happened to Hellgate London? Uh, it sold. It didn't make the money it wanted to make, and then they sold the company. Uh, TX, or rather True. Yes, yes, we're ready. True, we're ready. You're going to get your brain back. Ta-da, you got your brain back. Now, where's my stupid chinchilla? Frodo, go to Hordor. Okay, um, maybe I'll try a new zone. For some reason or another, sometimes they just, like, don't listen. Uh, so, Chinchilla, go to Area 1. There we go. Because everybody's waiting on you and you're holding everyone up. Alright, bye-bye, Proto Eden. Proto Chinchilla. Keep those turrets hot. I like the additional uranium. Alright, they're finding their way. 
I don't need to encourage them. I'm gonna keep one of these turrets on to try to draw noise. Ah, we'll fire them all up. Time bomb is a go frenzy. Uh, make sure restrictions are stay home, not close. That way no one waltzes into the kill box while this happens. the delicious amounts of gunfire. Having everyone have assault rifles is just so awesome. It's been a long time coming. Alright, so he's back with us. I guess while I'm staring at this, I'll do some mining up. I don't really like having combat happen while I'm out looking, but, you know. It's like real men staring at explosions, right? Something like that. Uh, Alright, so there's a zombie tortoise. It's in the back here. Power these off. And a raid. Someone ordered pizza? No, no one ordered pizza. Oh, these raiders are gonna get m just demolished. I'm going to go back to my walls. We'll get them demolished. Man, my ambitious project here is really just not seeing the day of light. A light of day. The other way around. Someday, one day. All right, let's uh let's have some fun with these guys. Firing up the slugger. bunch of uh, people with grenades and stuff. Yeah, they're all dead. All right, everybody go take a knee. Uh, but before I forget to do it, let's close these doors. I'm going to allow all so we can get some meat. Wildlife. Let's hunt some elephants and alpacas. Yeah, let's go for the elephants. We need the meat. Uh, cheese. Let's risk wake up. All right, cheese. You are going to be unrestricted, and maybe for once, chat will allow me to do some real hunting. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know if this is hunting. Oh, it's so not hunting. Alright, so, uh, all the elephants got pissed. As you can hear from the combat music, they are all headed my way. Luckily, Cheese is Iron Man, essentially, and runs really, really fast. Oh no! I closed the door behind me. Wait, where are they running to? There we go. No, don't stand in front of the slugger. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, one shot, that thing goes down. Hit him in the spine. Hey, we get to eat people! I mean, we get to eat, comma, people. Okay, I, I really should be careful about how I ever phrase that. We get some food! Alright, let's close these back up. And wildlife. Alpacas. Let's tame some rats. When we have the chance. And hunt some rhinos. Rats are going to be good door openers, I think. Mm. 
Alice needs some help, but she's fast, right? Yeah, yeah, she's fast. Why? Because she's a jogger? Yeah, she's a jogger. I don't think this elephant's going to fare all that well. Oh, we are getting rats. Good job, time bomb. All right, uh, another thing. The zone here, the ambrosia zone. Let me trim away unnecessary uh, parts of the zone, if we're going to keep it. It'd be really, really cool to have Ambrosia. That will help us avoid some um, mental breakdowns. But I don't want a giant zone where they come out and they're trimming trees or whatever. So that's going to be enough. Tame some more rats. Oh, speaking of which, uh, handle. Okay, yeah, yeah, the, the people that should be handling are correct. Good, good. Poor rhinos. Oh, got another rat. So yeah, I, I forget who originally... Ooh, masterwork. Dang! Alright, T-Sang, you want this thing? I bet you do. And then this good one's gonna go to Pat. And T, you are set up as a hunter. Yeah, good. All right, well, let's see how far along this project I get. Who's starving? Mord? Oh yeah, you've been out hunting for a while. So if you're curious about this zone here, um, I do have plans to make this interesting, that, that spot there, uh, if I'm ever able a breather. But it seems like I'm getting a breather right now, so I appreciate the, the breather that you are all offering me. That's oh, pretty hot out, isn't it? 102? Gross. Oh, speaking of breather, the storyteller this time decides to send me Arctic Wolves. Oh boy. Alright, uh, one, two, three. I'm gonna travel out to hunt them this time rather than to have them invert a bunch of the local flora and fauna over to to, uh, zombies. It's far more effective to go hunt them. Um, but I do want to make some room for, sorry, happy, for, uh, some meat. Oh, what? I just un... Darn it. My bad. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. These wolves don't know where they're going, so we'll just regroup one big group. While they're out there, I'm going to stay home. I don't have anyone else that shouldn't be out there wandering around. Exotic Goods coming over. Nice. He's, um, Can. Sorry, Can. Pull you from hunting. Get you to trade. Hmm. Male and female iguanas, chinchillas again. Plasteel cooking neuro trainer, sure, I guess. Why not? Heart lungs, I'm gonna keep. Oh, they have an architect leg, but not that I can afford it. Elephant tusks, I can sell. Forget the cookie trainer. I should kind of probably build up my wealth 
Ooh, but they have a mega screen TV, so... You know what? They also had a uh, telescope. Uh, so I have to figure out how to form the telescope somehow. I don't have need of the power claw. Ah, but that seems like such a waste to sell. Um... I'll sell a little bit of my, uh, let's see, a little bit of my meds, or food, rather. Because I can always make more. Alright, now we have some proper rec. I just don't even have a place for this TV. I could, guess I could put it there. And reinstall this in the hospital. I'm really going to have to redesign the hospital, I know this, because you all voted for it and I just haven't done it yet. But I am up over up time, I know. Let me just uh, clear up these wolves here, and then we'll call it. Wolves converted some alpaca to the dead. Legions of the dead. Happy Pants, did you ever, ever end up butchering? Oh, I see. You're making uh, kibble. Uh, let's make the kibble underneath that, changing the order, the queue. I think despite the rainy thunderstorm, there's enough shooters that this should just be fine. Alright, those alpaca are going to turn, but I don't really have a, a way to stop... Oh no, they were minigunned. Oh yeah, never mind, never mind. I think we're good. I think that's all the zombies. So guys, that's about all the time I have. I just wanted to take a second um, to tell all of you about next, well, not next, maybe not next Saturday. It depends on how complex the uh, the tool, to, uh, tool kit integration will be. Um, but potentially there'll be another series launching soon. Now, Jordan, one of my community members, have been modding things like the AVP mod and um, the Lord of the Rims mod to be... Uh, functional inside of Twitch Toolkit. Um, I'm going to be posting in just about a few hours or so a poll about what you want to see for Saturdays. Whether you want the AVP, the uh, Lord of the Rims, more Survive the Swarm, or more Kenshi on the Rim. And uh, be looking for that poll. If you're curious about that, just rattlemouth.com or Discord. And while I've got you, if you have feedback about this series, all you got to do is uh, let me know. I'm going to be sticking around. Uh, in chat. Uh, there was a quick question about the AVP mod. It is the Aliens vs. Predators mod that's going around on RimWorld. Alright guys, well if there's any other um, feedback that you have for me, um, like I said, I'm sticking around. To all the people that subbed, uh, donated bits, anything like that, thank you so very much. I actually missed uh, thanking you a little bit, so like, practice for instance subbed and I didn't even notice, so thank you guys. And I'll, uh, I'll catch you all Wednesday, I suppose. Adios!